Sup y'all, bringing guys another video. So just bringing guys the latest when it comes to Donnie Nietes, Ahas, the snake. Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So um, yeah, as you guys can tell by the title, Nietes will be back before the end of the year in December, December 11, 2021, over in the UAE. To those who don't know, Donny Nietes is now under Probellum Promotions. If you guys don't know what Probellum Promotions is, uh, it's the new uh, promotional company that Richard Schaefer, the former president and CEO of, um, of uh, Golden Boy Promotions, he's decided to create another promotional company named Probellum. And uh, he has a, a big event coming up on the 11th of December with Sonny Edwards versus Jason Mama headlining the event and we have Gian Real Casimiro versus Butler co-featuring the event over in the UAE um, over at the uh, Coca-Cola Arena and uh, Donny Nietes will be part of that card. They have yet to announce the opponent. Uh, they haven't announced anything yet. We are about a month away from fight day so they have to announce it ASAP and, uh, and yeah unknown what channel will be on. Um, I hope they announce a network soon. But anyway, Donny Nietes, it's, it's been a while. Um, Donny Nietes, 39 years old now. Uh, arguably one of the top five Filipino boxers of all time from the Philippines, in my opinion, arguably. Um, he's kind of getting up there in age now, 43 and 1, 5 draws, 23 wins coming by way of Nakar Tikio. He actually fought earlier this year back in April uh, over in, the, in Dubai as well. Um... But uh, I was busy, too busy preparing for the wedding, for our, our, our wedding. And, you know, I, I wasn't really focused on boxing at that time. So I, I honestly didn't pay attention to uh, what happened to this fight. But he did win by unanimous decision. And now here he is. Um, second fight of the year. And second fight since his uh, fight against uh, Kazuto Oyoka, where he won the WBO title. If you guys don't know, he vacated that title because the WBO wanted him to fight Ayoka again. And he didn't want to fight Ayoka again. So he vacated that title and he was gone for three years. Uh, and uh, now here he is. Still competing, still active. Um, still highly ranked under the sanctioning bodies. Number six under the WBC. Number four under the uh, WBA. And number three under the uh, WBO. So... I just hope he fights somebody in the top 15. That's all I'm hoping for. Can be anybody in the top 15. Um, I just hope it's someone decent. And so that he can get in the mix against the likes of Estrada, Jorin Ancajas, Kazuto Ayoka, Chocolatito, Soren Wurung Bisai. You know, there's a, there's a lot of, a lot of talent here at 115 pounds. And if not Nietes can, you know, get some good wins, he can get one of these fights before he retires. So... Hopefully his fight in December will be a good one. I'll keep you guys updated on it. So subscribe if you haven't yet. Please hit that like button if you haven't yet. Please let me know your thoughts and comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.